I think we are very fortunate to have Shang. Her journey, her dedication really inspired the newer generation. She was just one of us that worked hard or maybe for the newer generation. <laughs> That's the company. <laughs> oh, good to see you. Good to see you. How are you doing, buddy? <laughs> That's amazing seeing Chow. He is a second dad to me. Chow, do you still collect all the trophies in here? Or? Not all of them. Oh, okay. Knowing that I was Chow's like first successful gymnast, it's really special to now see him kind of turn this into an empire in Iowa. So they have memorized their warm-up. It makes me really proud but just to see how much the gym has grown and how many successful girls he has. Our life right now is consumed with wedding planning. We're only three months away. It's getting super close and crazy and all the final details are kind of being put into place. It takes a long time to transition out of something that you've committed your whole life to. I don't know if I'll ever find anything just like gymnastics, so I'm still trying to find my groove. <laughs> I remember going to the 2012 tour and watching the girls perform, and I just thought, like, I miss this. I just want to be down there competing. We're doing a workout this morning. Keep going, keep going. Yep, yep. Having that little nagging feeling of, like, could I go back? It definitely made signing up for the tour a lot easier. It'd be a good way for me to like, get healthy again and get my knee working and functioning and get back into the gym and play around. I think she will be competing like forever. <laughs>